launching Marconi House for the first time in the UK. Uh, the development and the building is nearly finished. Galliard and Fogmore formed a joint venture and using Galliard's construction skills and marketing skills uh, and, and finance that we both provided, uh, we've been able to create here 86 wonderful apartments. And because we think the product is so good, we hope that many of the people that have bought here will go on to buy on our future developments and our future prime developments in London. We're also using it as an opportunity to launch the Galliard Platinum collection of uh, upmarket properties in London. We've got a development in Belsize Park, Red Lion Court just along the road in, close to Fleet Street. Uh, we have Great Cumberland Place. Uh, we've got Wapping Riverside, New Capital Quay on the river, and Marconi House, which is at the moment our jewel in the crown. We do almost all of our own construction in-house. So across the group, which turns over about 250 million, our in-house construction company, we do about 120 million pounds worth of construction every year. We're about to launch a much larger scheme in central London which will be the similar quality to this so we've gone up market we believe we can still offer value we believe that people who buy from us will actually be able to make a profit on their investment and turn it on so hence we've gone right into the centre into zone one all of our experience comes from building in central London of all of the apartments that we're building, almost all of them are within, within the A406. So we're, we're very used to it and it's something that we're, we're good at. Specifically the London residential market has been a, really a safe haven for lots of international money coming into the UK. We're finding that investors are buying to invest, they're buying for their kids who are at London universities, they're buying for themselves when they're on holiday, and they consider, I suppose they consider prime London property similar to an investment in gold. It's a steady value, we've had drop in value of sterling, we've had interest rates at record lows, and what better is there to buy than a prime piece of central London?